HTC has pulled back the curtain on its new flagship device, the HTC One M8, which runs Android KitKat. The device, which is covered in brushed metal, packs quite the punch. It's got a quad-core Snapdragon processor, 2 gigabytes of RAM, 16 or 32 gigabytes of onboard storage space, a 5-inch 1080p display, and a screen made of Corning's Gorilla Glass 3. The phone features two front-facing speakers with built-in amplifiers and sound balancing software, as well as a 2600 milliamp hour battery, which basically translates to about 20 hours of talk time, although some are reporting even more hours of use. But then there's the camera. It's a low-resolution camera with giant pixels for capturing more light, and a writer for The Verge calls it a major flaw. Photos are mushy and soft, as if nothing's ever quite in focus. The new one does do far better than last year's camera, but this is not a good camera. Still, HTC attempts to boost its camera cred by offering a feature called U-Focus, which captures multiple focus areas, allowing users to choose between them. ABC reports BlinkFeed, a home screen that showed users news and social media updates, is making a return, but it won't be the standard home screen. Instead, users will swipe to view their Blink feed. And Leslie Horn of Gizmodo says HTC's motion launch gestures add to the package. You can knock twice to wake the phone up. You can swipe left to go home or swipe right to go to Blink feed. You can tilt the phone sideways and hit the volume button to start the camera. The base device is now available on most U.S. carriers where it'll run you $199.99. For Newsy, I'm Micah Sargent.